What's going on guys? It's your boy Adjen Bagen for another Outer Plane video and for today it's your last chance to get your hands on air one of the best DPS for the power element. I can confidently say that Air is a really really good character and I think she is a mass summon in my honest opinion. So what are you doing if you still don't have her? Try and get her because you will not regret summoning for her because she is that damn good. Uh, she is really great and not only that one she is pretty much waifu. And look at her she's very pretty very gorgeous. Damn that legs. And also, not only a top tier waifu, also top tier voice actor, which is uh, Iparus, uh, a very popular uh, VA in JP right now. And uh, she trivializes PBE. Yes, PBE contents for the power, power element because uh, she is pretty darn strong against Chimera Hunt 12. If you've seen a lot of Chimera Hunt 12s uh, that, that are 3 star tier, Air is always present in most of their, those clears. Uh, although you can still clear uh, Hunt 12 without her. Although that one will take uh, some uh, really nice uh, heavy gear investment. Probably or maybe some uh, resources to level up your uh, with the other character in Empire. The two star uh, that can burn. Iris. Yeah. So you might want to invest on Iris if you don't have air. But having air in your... Uh, arsenal or in your box is really really gr helpful and uh, will make you trivialize those uh, PBE card contents and also if you have not seen the updated uh, patch notes yet uh, we have upcoming special request identification stages 11 and 12 now this one are the stages where you can farm weapons and accessories uh, they are going to be introducing now stage 11 and stage 12 for those ones and if you don't have air you might have some trouble fighting against twin beetle twin beetle is really really hard even the stage 10 is already pretty hard before uh, but air trivializes that one so if you don't have air you might have some trouble that is why it is a really really good reason to summon for air uh, if you plan to to, to be farming uh, those dungeons uh, what are the benefits of farming uh, those dungeons, uh, the Twin Beetle? Uh, because some of you might not know that in Twin Beetle uh, dungeon stages, no, not this one. This is where you can get your attack, uh, attack accessories. Attack accessories and then uh, some uh, evasion, evasion, accuracy and heals when hit. Uh, that is the this is the stage where you can get those uh, accessory stats so having be having been able to clear this one uh, the hunt 11 and 12 uh, is really really good also uh, not this one there's a really good accessory here uh, I think for the for the for the tank Where is it? Ah, this one. This is where you can farm the Orius uh, accessory. Uh, it's pretty popular in uh, tanks. I've already made a lot of showcases about air on my channel. So just check that one out. Uh, if you're still unsure on uh, whether to summon for her or not. She's really darn good. She's really darn strong. And I believe she is a mass summon. So try and get a copy of her. Her shards are farmable in the side story, so you don't really need to aim for the dupes. Just aim to get one copy, and you will not regret it. Well, anyway guys, I think that's it for me for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.